guess who's back? It's Chatsworth's favorite neighbors who love to compete. Keeping up with the Kandasamis has evolved over the years. And now, in a brand new installment, there's a new addition to the family. I think a huge congratulations is in order. You're going to be a granny. Yes, I'm going to be a granny. I'm super excited. The world's going to see my grandchild together with a family story with so much of love and so much of heart. I think it's, um, it reflects us, you know, uh, the way we are around babies and then you'll have the one pulling this way and the other one pulling that way and then there's a little bit of competition around. Uh, how do we do this? Maintain a peaceful and calm atmosphere at all times. Kandasami, the baby, is the latest film in this proudly South African franchise, directed and co-written by Jay and Moodley. Yes, it's set in the Indian South African community and for me it was very important representation, especially little kids, teenagers, to see people who look like them on screen and to be able to think oh, we have a belonging, we have a sense of belonging. But more than that, I wanted this film to reach everyone. And wearing more than one hat this time around. This movie is particularly special to me because I was a writer for it as well. And, uh, and so um, it's very dear to my heart and special. It was hard work writing. We had three blockbusters and it was big shoes to fill. The film premieres on the streaming platform Netflix this week in over 190 countries. The three hugely successful installations already under their belt. This one promises to be as entertaining. And in the words of our favorite granny, wake up, there's a baby around the corner. Be there, you don't want to miss it. <laughs> there you have it, wake up, Tanya Neff, Durban. <laughs> Bye.